Happy New Year's. I'm back for 2014. My name is Kevin, and I'm here to show you some knowledge that I've learned with Dragon Dictation over the years. I haven't been keeping up on my videos, so for 2014 New Year's resolution, I'm going to be better on that. Now let's start with the Mac Dragon Dictation. If you've upgraded to Apple's new operating system, Mavericks, you might have some frustrations using Dictations at first to actually reconnect it. I'm going to go ahead and go up to my spotlight and get Dragon Dictation up. Now, it's going to give you a warning if you do not have the most current version in here, which is fine. Let's go ahead and continue. But Dragon Dictation cannot run because it has to be accessed to the accessibility panel inside of the Mac computer. I'm going to go ahead and hit, click OK. Now you can see in the top right that my accessibility is turned on but you can see that there's no place to really turn it on inside the accessibility panel inside of the Mac OS X. It's actually moved to security so let's go ahead and click on show all in system preferences and go to privacy and security. Now there's four tabs on the top. If you click on the privacy one make sure you go down to accessibility and then we need to give Dragon Dictation access. We're going to go ahead and unlock it you put your password in and go ahead and allow it. Now when I launch Dragon Dictation it comes up, continue and I can accept the new terms now and actually download the new version. I will be trying to put more videos up online to actually show more about Dragon Dictation and actually really growing with it this year, 2014. So I hope this tip helps. It was very frustrating for me when I upgraded to Mavericks thinking that I have to wait for months for uh, Nuance to update, but actually it was a very easy fix that I just didn't know about. So there you go, and hope to see you soon.